to install w files on a Linux machine, you have two options. You can uh, install it with apt-get install command on your Linux machine. Or you can go to the GitHub page for WFAS and download the file from there and install on your machine. First, I show you how to install it with apt-get. If you are not a root user, you need to use sudo apt-get install and wfuzz. I already downloaded it, so uh, wfuzz is already the newest version on my machine. But if you don't have wfuzz uh, on your machine, it starts installing these two. If you are going to download the file from GitHub, from this uh, page, github.com, xmendes, wfuzz, github.com, for slash xmendes, for slash wfuzz. You need to click here on code and click here to copy the page, uh, the link, or you can select this link and Copy it, then type git clone and the link which ends with .git. I already downloaded this uh, file, I uh, cloned it, so I uh, don't use git clone again. Go to the file, go to the directory, in fact, wfuzz, there are some uh, files, but we need these two, uh, uh, these two files, requirements, and that uh, requirements, .txt, and setup.py. So, uh, first, I use sudo pip install tag r and requirements to download all uh, tools that are required for WFAS. To install uh, WFAS now after downloading the requirements, I use setup.py, python setup.py install. This way I can uh, install WFAS on my Kali machine uh, because uh, I didn't use sudo, I get this error, so this time I use sudo If you get any error during the installation, you can go to the doc documentation for wfuzz wfuzz.readthedocs.io and from here, the navigation, you can select installation. It shows you the way that you can install uh, WFAS and you can read the page wfaz.read.readthedocs.io to become more familiar with WFAS. Here you see. Uh, the installation issues and you can uh, solve any problem. 